She Geeked On here. It is September 2nd, Wednesday, and my final full day of quarantine. Final full day of quarantine. Thursday, I have a half day to go, but this is it for the full day. So finding little bits and pieces to do because now I'm kind of in um, rearrange everything that's left mode. So it looks good for the real estate dude. Um, the thing is, there's not much I can do with this. Uh, I'm just trying to pack up and consolidate as much as I can because obviously I have to consolidate anyway. It's got to fit in my car. <laughs> um, but Walter has a pretty big trunk. He's a thick boy, so uh, it, it shouldn't be too bad. Um, this stuff is uh, donation stuff that is going to be going before the real estate guy gets here. So I'm not concerned with that. But right now, I'm going to work on getting the family clock packed away. Uh, there is a history behind the clock. It came from Holland. Um, every brother and sister has one. So my mom and my two uncles. <laughs> and I've left it basically uh, until the last minute. It's It's been here the whole time. Uh, it's been hanging on the wall. And I just... Honestly, last time I think I forgot it because it was hanging on the wall and I didn't take it down. So this time around, I'm going to pack it up right now, actually. I'm going to see how well I can pack it and if I can put some other stuff in the box with it. And uh, we'll see how that goes. But that's me this morning on my final full day of quarantine. So I decided to play a little pool this afternoon. This is the pool table that's going with the house. Lovely 70s vibe with the Formica kind of top on it. But considering the age, I don't ever recall my dad uh, having to get the felt replaced. So it's in pretty excellent condition. But kind of my last few times being able to play. So uh, yeah, this main reason it's staying is because I remember the hell they went through to get it into the basement. Um, lumbering it around, removing the railing from the basement stairs. It was, it was quite a feat of involving multiple men um, attempting <laughs> to get this thing down the stairs and around a very tight turn. Basically, the stairs came down one way, then there's a wall there, and then the pool table had to go in the other direction. So, so yeah, I'm just playing for a bit, but I uh, thought I'd give you the pool table story. Since I know you're wondering, yes, I did manage to get the clock packed up. <laughs> I have this nice big relatively big, uh, rectangular box. So the clock ended up fitting quite well going diagonally. Rearranged a few things. I was able to fit a few more fragile pieces in there on top of the clock, which worked out well. And uh, yeah, that bit of packing did pretty well. So aside from that, today I managed to Put a few things up for either sale or free and I've gotten some interest. I did it on the Facebook marketplace this time which I hadn't tried before so it's a little interesting but I've managed to have one person say for sure they're picking up a freebie. Um, I'm giving away these like four free vinyl chairs um, because they're just gonna sit around and get picked up by the junk guys anyway so I'm just like hey someone wants them I'm good with that. There's a couple more I'm waiting on, but it'll be nice if I can just get stuff out and not have to wait for the other guys to pick them up. So we'll see what happens. But yeah, that pretty much draws my final full day to a close. I've got my half day tomorrow and I already have plans for the afternoon. So I hope you're having a good one. Bye for now.